Hello everybody, in this video we're going to look at how to construct perpendicular lines. So here's our setup. We have line M drawn on our paper and we have point P drawn above our line. So that's our setup. What we're going to do is we're going to draw or we're going to construct a perpendicular line that goes through point P and is perpendicular to line M. Now in this video we're not going to do a perpendicular bisector. We'll do another video where we look at how to construct a perpendicular bisector. So for this one we're just doing perpendicular lines. So we're not necessarily worried about if our perpendicular line goes through the middle of our uh, line M, because once again, this is not a bisector. This is simply just a perpendicular line. Um, I'll link the video to the perpendicular bisector uh, below. All right, so what we're gonna do to start off is we're gonna put the needle of our compass on point P, and we are just going to make an arc on um, line M that intersects line M twice. So we'll put the needle at P, and we're gonna draw an arc and just make sure this arc intersects two places on our line, okay? So now we have our arc and we have a couple intersections here. Let's label these intersections A and B. All right, so now what we're gonna do, um, it doesn't matter how, how your compass is at this point, if you wanna close it up a little bit, um, that's fine. But what we are going to do is put the needle at A and we're gonna make an arc down here and then we'll keep the compass open the same amount. We'll put the needle at B and we'll make another arc down here as well. So right now we're gonna put the needle at this intersection where we have A and we're just gonna make an arc down here just like this, okay? Now keep the compass open the same amount. Now move the needle to the intersection that we have labeled B and we're gonna make an arc down here. All right, so now notice we have an intersection down here. We could call this intersection C. And now we're gonna take our straight edge and we're just gonna draw a line that goes through our intersection and our point P, okay? So those should line up right on top of each other. And we're gonna draw our perpendicular line just like that, okay? And so now to indicate that this is a perpendicular line, we can draw our 90 degree or our right angle box right there. And we have constructed perpendicular lines. So we could say that line, we call this line PC, right? That would be our vertical line PC. And we could say it is perpendicular to, and we'll call this line M. And that's how you construct perpendicular lines.